Hey, see on friends, this is Allie Pierce again from Silver Springs, Florida, the, the place where a lot of the sea hunt episodes were filmed, and I have a special, very special episode for you today. I want you to meet somebody who's very special, special to me and special to anybody that likes sea hunt. This is Roosevelt Vason. We call him Ro. If you're his friend, you call him Ro. You guys call him Mr. Vason. He is very, very special. Look at the smile on him. <laughs> and he's very special for a simple reason. He's special to sea hunt people and to me because this gentleman has been running one of the glass bottom boats here at Silver Springs for 60 years. Now, you know what that means, don't you? Right. He was here when Lloyd Bridges, Mike Nelson, was filming right here at Silver Spring. Yeah, he remembers Mike Nelson. We've had other cast members and other people who worked with, with uh, Mike Nelson, uh, like Bridges on Sea Hunt as well. And, and but this is so special. And I've been out in the boat with Roosevelt. In 60 years, he's, he's pretty good with the boat. He's pretty good. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna, we're gonna chat with Roosevelt for just a moment. So, you, so do you remember, actually, that's a long time ago. Do you actually remember those days? I remember those days. You do? I do. <laughs> and and uh, now Silver Springs has been here for a long time. Uh, uh, has it changed very much over 60 years? The park has changed around. The river is pretty much the same. It's just as clear, just as beautiful as ever, just a little more algae growing. Right. Yeah. Well, I guess the river wouldn't change. But now, I know there used to be a big beach area and a water sports and people would swim and dive and so on. That's all gone now. It's all gone. Yeah. Yes, was that, uh, was there a good reason for that that you can think of? Were they just get messy or hard to supervise or why did they take all that fun well, stuff out of there? Well, it was getting to be a problem with uh, supervision of it and yeah. parents leaving the kids and whatnot. Here oh, yeah. Unsupervised. And you can't do that today. And then yeah. we uh, built wild waters on top of that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's, yeah, they've other attractions. Now, at one time, I think I'm right on when I say this, Silver Springs was it. Yeah, you right. came to Florida for the beaches and the warm weather, but if you wanted to have a fun time, you came to Silver Springs. There was no Disney World or anything else. Well, back in the day when you were talking about, when you came to Florida, it was Silver Springs, Cypress Gardens, and Miami Beach, and that was Florida. That was it. That was, that was it, yeah. yeah. Well, that's fantastic. And now, of course, there's lots of things to see in Florida, but Silver Springs is still Silver Springs. Still, still Silver Springs, Springs so, now, so now, Tommy, here's what we want to hear. Do you actually remember Lloyd Bridges? I remember Lloyd Bridges. Oh, yeah. wow. Yeah, really do. And, and just generally, just what was your impression of him? Just another guy, or was he? He was a, he was a very great guy, friendly guy. Was he? Oh, yeah, he used to. Once in a while, he would come by and say hi to the guys in the break room. Just an old, old, old nice wow. guy. That's, a, well, that's the impression that we have of the whole Bridges family and Lloyd himself. Yeah, yeah. And well, that's really good to hear. Yeah. yeah. So, so when uh, did he uh, did he ever go on the glass bottom boats for a little trip around? He came back and did a commercial for us. Oh, was that right? On the glass bottom boat. Well, I didn't know that. Yeah. And then he came up with the. He told the people, you can see all this without getting your feet wet. And then he <laughs> come up with this idea, did you see that? <laughs> and that was, I think it brought a lot of people to the park. Is that right? Huh? As long as we heard that, did you see that? <laughs> I didn't know that. Yeah. Well, well, he was a good guy, and uh, and and uh, I liked to uh, having fun too. So yeah, that yeah. makes sense as well. Yeah, and and then other people I know. For instance, uh, we were really happy to see Betty Frazy, who was a local girl as well, a world record swimmer, and she was a stunt girl for some of the Sea Hunt episodes filmed right here. Mm -hmm. And there's lots of other people, uh, Jack, and of course Bruce Mozart. You know yeah. him. He oh, just yeah. he just died a short while ago. So, and you know of others? Are there many people around? I guess there's not many around, right, from the 50s? Well, Leon Cheatham is still around. He lived right up here in Silver Springs. Right. Yeah, and he was around during those days. Uh, what about boat captains? Were there not too many of them? You're pretty much not it? Not too many boat captains, no. Yeah, you're it. Pretty much it. And you still drive the boats? You're not just still, on shore making sure? Still driving the boats. You like the boats, yeah? Still know my way down the river and back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, that's been great. I, I don't know what else. Now I think we're going to go for a ride on uh, on uh, Rose Boat, and uh, and maybe we'll take the folks for a little ride down on one of your famous trips. Sound good to me. You're going to have to do a good job. You know, we don't want no. We mess always do a good job. We we don't want no <laughs> messing around. <laughs> maybe we'll even see a gator out there. Keep your fingers crossed. Maybe cross. okay. Well, that's great. So there you go, Sean fans, Roosevelt. Boat captain, 
for Light Bridges when Mike Nelson was being filmed right here in Silver Spring. Okay, we're going to do some more of this. You keep in touch. Watch those episodes. Alec Pierce, Sea Hunt Forever.